unboxing another FabFitFun box spring fall edition I believe not too sure this is a mystery box so we're gonna get right fucking into it disclaimer I'm drunk but I am gonna open this box first so we have the whole box open. Just like the first one, we got another video. Uh, just like the first video, we have another magazine. Awesome, cool, awesome. Talks about this shit. Then we got another HelloFresh gift card. This was a gift card last time. I totally fucked up. But, you know, here's the box. We're gonna start off with this. Yeah. Hopefully again. There's another little description about what's gonna be in here. But yeah, you know what? We're just gonna get right fucking into it. Right fucking into it. So, first item, we got this Tula Probiotic Skin Car uh, Skincare Purifying Face Cleanser. Show you that there. Pretty big bottle actually, 200 milliliters. Says my face. Not bad. I like the color. We also have this UI hair care leave-in conditioner. That's not bad either. Show you that. Another little zoom in there. See how that works. Pretty excited about that. Next item is Needles No More, No More Baggage Eye Deep Puffing Gel. This visibly reduces the looks of under eye bags, dark circles, etc. There's that one. I'm just gonna let it focus for a minute. Come on, there we go. Can you see it? Maybe move my face a little fucking way. Come on. There. Can't really read it. I'm gonna open it. Let's see what's inside here. <clears throat> Just another little small kind of bottle we got going on right here. Show you that. Hopefully it'll zoom. For some reason, every time. I fucking swear at this thing, it decides to zoom in and probably show you what the fuck this is supposed to be. No more baggage, everybody read that. Sorry, my ring light's just fucking with me here. Third item, wow, yay, awesome. I know I don't sound totally enthused, but you know, I'm drunk, give me some fucking slack, okay. Levito, inspired by nature. It's a little cute thing. That's not bad. Don't know how much it is. It says aromic body lotion. Hopefully it smells good. I don't know why, but for some reason, they always, of course, there's no little fucking silver thing. You gotta make it hard for me, right? You gotta make it fucking hard. So, and of course I got ghetto ass ratchet fake nails right now. Don't judge me, but here, there's a full zoom for ya. Fuck yeah, Ooh. Shut up. It's smoky, by the way. My brother's cat. It's not my cat. He just likes to hang out in my room. I'm still fucking trying to get this open, by the way. I'm still trying. Don't worry. You know, the teeth always work. Maybe not. Hopefully I don't get this in my mouth, because then we might have some issues. Okay, there we go. Again, smells like normal old lady fucking granny hand cream. yippee ki -yay. Not even excited about this. Whatever. All right. 
Oh, I got a necklace. Ooh. The two bandits. That's pretty fucking cute. There's that. I don't know if you can see that, but cute little necklace. Little accessories, you know. Add that to my collection there. Pretty nice. What is that? Says avoid danger. Okay. Instructions on not putting a bag on your head. Who would have fucking thought? Alright, bitches. Let's just throw that out of the way. Ooh. Comes in a little fancy bag. What does that say? Dulux. Okay. We're gonna see what the fuck is in here. I love it when they always give us little fabric bags because you think it's gonna be expensive. Guess what? We got another frickin' handbag. Oh, it's a backpack, I lied. Backpack, see ya, uh, back straps. So, they're adjustable, so that's nice. I'm just gonna do that quick. Just that crap. The only thing I don't like is that there's no things to like put those or tuck those in. So that is kind of a downfall for me, personally. I mean, you could flip it back and try and tuck it in behind, but is anybody actually gonna waste their time trying to fucking do that? Let's be honest, probably not. Okay, is that even? <laughs> is that even? I don't fucking think so. Okay, we're gonna try that again here. This better be way more fucking entertaining than my last video, just for the record. Yay, I got a bag. It doesn't even say anything on it. Just like last time. Who's it by? Who's it by? That's just saving grace. It looks like a beach bag. Care instructions. Vegan leather and will smooth out after normal use. Wipe down your tote and hang to dry. Blah, blah, blah. Well, obviously I'm gonna wipe this shit down. Okay, so it's by Dulux. And this is the bag. This is the little clasp thing. There's no zipper. There's no pockets. There's a little tiny inside pocket that separates. That's it. For me, personally, not really impressed with this bag. It doesn't have a full clasp, it's just a leather strap that just fucking sits there and goes, yeah, hey, there's a hole here, cool. If you actually have a lot of shit in this bag, like I normally do because I always bring more than what I need 90% of the time, this bag isn't gonna work for you. I'm sorry, bad fit fun. Quit sending me bags that aren't gonna work for me because personally, I'm not digging this. I'm probably not gonna use it. Comment below if you want this or I'm gonna put it on my Depop. I'll also post a lip. Uh, uh, sorry for my fucking poor grammar and my mispronunciations. I'm gonna put this on my Depop. There we go. And if you want it or you like it, you know, Dulux bag going back in the fabric fucking thing that it came in. All I did was adjust the straps. Here's your proof. It's going to sit in the box until somebody wants it. Because personally, I'm not going to fucking use this. See ya, Dulux. Holding out some faith. At least this bag has some color that I like. It's a picnic set. Are you fucking kidding me? This? How does this look like a picnic set? We're gonna open this, okay? I am gonna be the full judge of this because I am skeptical now. How is this supposed to be a picnic set? Like, this is the size of a plate. I get that. Is there plates in here? Is this gonna be like a whole fucking lunch package? Like, I don't even understand. Okay. So, we got some fucking plates. 
some nice little plastic cutlery if you want to go camping. You know, I'll have some cute shit in a bag. Who is actually going to use this? Spring, fall, people that go camping. I have to <coughs> For real though? What the fuck is this? I like this. I thought there was going to be like makeup brushes or something cool. Spring 2019, that's what the box says. Well, you know what, Fab Fit Fab? We're holding out for your summer box, and then I think we might be done with you because you've been just doing nothing to disappoint me. Aside from this slice conjure and this deep conditioner, I like those, and I like this. This is cute. We're just gonna go back to that because that was a nice item. This thing. Sorry. There we go. That's cute, and hopefully that works. I'm gonna do a review on this. Comment below if you'd like to see me post a video on doing a review and see if this actually fucking works. And guess what, guys? No description this time. No prices. Nothing. Nothing else in this box. Except for this lotion shit, which I'm even skeptical to open. But I'm still going to show you what it is. Okay. Champagne charcoal scrub. Okay, this is actually something that I'm actually probably gonna use. Okay, it's a body scrub, but I might use it on my face. Is that acceptable? Comment below. I don't fucking know. Are you gonna judge me if I use this on my face? I already use a charcoal exfoliating kind of drying out face thing on my face now and you know I kind of like it so why would not use a scrub with charcoal in it does that not make sense it's for your body but do I am I really gonna use this on my body probably not it's probably just gonna sit in the fucking doom basket that's in my bathroom because that's where all my shit that I don't use is gonna go but this is what it looks like it's by relax maybe I don't know it's a cute little bucket there's actually a lot in here I'm gonna open it and see what it, see what we got going on in here another tinfoil fucking thing I'm not even gonna bother opening this I'm sorry guys but we'll just kind of see if this will zoom on here I don't know if you can see that but there's some speckles and stuff in there and some cool shit so hopefully that works i'm gonna try and use it so that was my spring 2019 box nothing else in here just some confetti which katrina threw on me last time what are my thoughts on this box honestly I don't even know at this point. I think I'm holding way too high, but it's for these boxes. And I'm just continually being disappointed. Because I don't fucking know what else to do. Do I use HelloFresh? No. Should I start using HelloFresh? Do other people use HelloFresh? Is it worth it? I don't know. Is that something that we need to discuss? Is there other people that know or think that this is worth purchasing as well? Because I do have those two gift cards now. Or should instead I do a little giveaway and the next two people. Man, that's a lot of thought process. I don't know if I can do that. Some sort of giveaway next episode on my next summer box because this is the spring box and again there were some things that I'm not going to use and there were some things that I probably will use and I don't know what I'm going to rate it out of 10 this time and like same thing I wouldn't say yes but I wouldn't say no there's certain things in this box that I'm quite impressed with 
And then there's other things in the box that I wasn't as impressed with. The sleeping conditioner, most likely will use. Hand cream that smells like original, regular hand cream. Am I gonna use this? Eventually, maybe, if I run out of other stuff and I have nothing else to use, maybe I'll use this. Maybe I'll take it to work and I'll give it to somebody. Or maybe I'll do a giveaway for this. Or maybe I'll sell it on my Depop. I really don't fucking know, but I'm not impressed with this. Pick better scents. If you're gonna give lotions and hand shit out and sprays and all that kind of shit, pick better scents. That's all I have to say. I'm so tired of this shit. Everything smells organic and normal and natural, and I don't want that. I want things that smell girly and like throw some Bath and Body Works fucking scents in here, like cinnamon, mint, peppermint, Japanese cherry blossom. Like, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Just pick better scents. Pick something that you would actually fucking want to put on your hands because if you're actually smelling this shit, no, no. Like a grandma's asshole? I don't think so. I don't want to smell like a grandma's asshole. I'm sorry. But I've lived my life for 23 fucking years now and I never wanted to smell like a grandma's asshole. No pun intended to my grandmas. I love them. But still, no one wants to smell like a grandma's asshole. Hopefully this smells good too. Purifying cleanser. Another fucking silver seal. I love this game. Seriously, they love just a, they just love making this shit hard for me. I'm not gonna be able to smell that. Fucking game over for that. Hopefully this thing works. We'll see. Okay, so it's just a little tiny tubule thing with a little applicator. That's it. That's not exciting. But hopefully it works. I'm gonna do a review on that. And I'll also do like a little get ready with me every morning kind of little morning prep thing. Not sure when I'm gonna film that, but it's gonna be soon. I have so many ideas. If you guys have any ideas, just let me know. Again, same fucking thing, to be lame. Comment below, subscribe, like my fucking shit, because it means a lot to me, and it helps me and motivates me to keep doing this shit. This thing, what are we rating this on? I'm not really impressed with it. I like the colors, I like that. I like that I can probably take this for lunch. This could be my new lunch fucking thing. That, that's about it. That's all I'm gonna look for. Taking it for lunch. Wow, cool. I got cutlery of my own. No no one no one makes that their life goal unless they're a fucking complete germaphobe hundred percent. This this is one of the only things that I'm gonna actually for sure use. So, you know what? Same thing, seven out of ten. I I don't know. I don't know what else to say out of that, but do I just order a Ferreo and say fuck it and unsubscribe? I want to hear your thoughts. I want to hear everyone's thoughts because I just don't know what to think at this point. Like I'm, I think I'm just holding t way too high of expectations for these boxes and stuff, and I'm not. I I don't know if I'm not doing it right or whatever else, but I think that. I need to start doing something different. Do you think we need to start doing some snacks? Edible feet me doing snacks? That would be cool. But yeah. I don't know. Comment, like, subscribe. I can't post any of the prices or anything for this time because they didn't give me a list or of a description or anything. But, you know, we got it. We got it figured out. And, uh, I'm gonna go to bed. Because I just got home from my friend Sam's birthday party. And guess what, honeys? Guess what? It's 2.16 in the fucking morning. And your girl's gotta go to bed. But we'll update you with another late night talk with Taz. Peace out, guys. Love you. Talk to you tomorrow.